hello everyone so today we are going to discuss about fiscal year variant and how to define fiscal year variant in the system so fiscal year is our own financial year used by our company to maintain balance sheet profit and loss or and all the external reports like statement of cash flows statement of changes in equity so fiscal year is our financial year and it have multiple periods like two types of periods are defined in the fiscal year normal periods and special periods normal periods are the normal periods like january is our normal period we have we are posting transactions in january so it is our normal period special periods are used to post adjustment entries like we have closed july uh, we have closed in uh, june june is our year end so after the june our audit team came and this is we have to post any specific adjustment so for this we use special periods so let's go and define fiscal year variant in the system maintain fiscal year variant so you have to follow this hierarchy financial accounting ledger fiscal year and posting period and maintain fiscal year variant so for our company we use july to june so we maintain tc fiscal year so this option is used if our, if our fiscal year and calendar year is same like our company is using january to december fiscal year so we have to check this option for our case we are using july to june so so we are using 12 normal periods and four special periods <coughs> fiscal weeks are used to post depreciation postings so for our case we are not using this if we are using we have to check this option so let's go and see a save this so this will be saved in the transport request so transport request is used to carry any specific information from one server to another server like we have three servers in the system development quality and production production is the live server which is used by end user quality server is used to test our specific scenarios and development server is used to configure to create new objects so define the periods so i have done this working so you are our saying this year shift year shift is used to shift our year like january which is in our fiscal year but is it is in but the calendar year of january is different so we are maintaining this year shift so our fiscal year is created so let's go and assign to our own company code assign go to our company code h01 so this is tc tc so assign here 
So let's go and create posting periods. Posting periods are used to maintain our number of periods in the fiscal year. Posting periods are the months in which we post financial transactions. Posting periods, posting period variant is used to close the month, monthly transactions in, in any specific period. So like we have closed the month of June. So we restrict the postings in the month of June by using posting period variant. So if we are using F5 postings, so we we are using this uh, OB52. So for CO it is different. So let's go and posting period. Define variants for open posting period. So we are using DC. DC post ascent posting period DC posting period this is our file on posting period so let's go and assign this assign variant to company code which is 01 this is our company code so we are using DC posting period and this is the posting period we defined so we use open so we have maintained all we are copying this and creating our own posting period this is DC PP Copying. So our posting period is created. For this, we open only one posting period. So We can only now if we I save this so we can only post in the first period of year 22 to, if we want to open any other period so we use if we want to open two period so we use two okay so these are the account types for which any period is opened or closed so if we use this account type we can post to all the account types a is used for acid d for customer vendor so for this we maintain this account types okay save so we have already assigned this to our company code in this transaction so if we want to log postings of business transaction for controlling specific only so we use ok p1 okay so actually I don't maintain the controlling area so let's go to the controlling area defined by system ok p1 so this is a00 fiscal year is 2022 for this we are using actual so if we want to log any period so we use this okay so I am not doing this we will discuss this in detail when we are doing controlling sessions so that's all for this video see you in the next okay thank you